Keeping up with the Windsors, Eugenie's wedding officially bigger than Meghan's after the royal invites 250 more guests to watch her marry long-term boyfriend Jack Brooks Bank. Princess Eugenie is so keen that her forthcoming wedding matches Harry and Meghan's that she has invited more guests to St. George's Chapel in Windsor than the church will actually hold. The Mail on Sunday understands that Eugenie, who will marry her long-term boyfriend Jack Brooks Bank on Friday, October 12, has invited more than 850 guests, meaning that extra chairs will have to be brought into the chapel, which seats just 800. In comparison Harry and Meghan invited just 600 guests to their wedding at the same venue in May. Jack, 31, and Eugenie, 28 also want their wedding to rival Prince Harry's on the celebrity guest front. Among those invited are George and Amal Clooney, David, and Victoria Beckham, Robbie and Ada Williams and artist Tracy Amin. After the 11 a.m. ceremony, the newlyweds will make a short carriage procession to St. George's Hall, where a traditional wedding breakfast attended by all the guests will be hosted by the Queen and Duke of York. A select 400 guests have also been invited to a champagne evening party at the family home, Royal Lodge in Windsor Great Park. Most senior royals will be at the church service and reception, although Eugenie's mother, the Duchess of York, is said to be terrified about the prospect of coming face to face with her former father-in-law, the Duke of Edinburgh who recovered from a hip operation in time to attend the last royal wedding. A royal insider close to the Duke says he wants to be there. He absolutely adores Eugenie. He can't stand up for very long, which makes church services hard work, and he can't stand Fergie, but he wants to see Eugenie married and, if he is fit enough to be there, he will be there. It won't be easy. Philip and Sarah will be in relatively close proximity to each other and Sarah's very nervous about it. People have been giving her some friendly advice. As long as she doesn't go over the top on the day, it should all be fine. The Yorks are spending an eye-watering £100,000 on a three-course dinner organized by upmarket catering firm Bentley's and are also paying for a marquee, complete with glass dance floor. The Duke is said to have chosen Bentley's which is run by Peregrine Armstrong Jones, half-brother of the late Lord Snowden. The wedding itself is going to be huge and they are hoping quite a few of the people they've invited won't be able to come because of the capacity issue, said one source. The evening party will be the party to end all others. Bentleys have done the York's birthday parties and they trust Peregrine for his expertise and discretion. It's also quite lovely there's a family link says the source. There are rumors Ellie Goulding and Robbie Williams will sing. A palace source said both bride and groom have large families to accommodate. Andrew has been keen to protect his daughter's status as royal princesses, particularly in the light of Prince Charles's plans for a slimmed-down monarchy, which would not feature his siblings' children so prominently. It is thought to be Andrew's wish that Eugenie be given a carriage procession like Harry and Meghan. This is the first time Andrew and his former wife Sarah Ferguson have co-hosted an event on such a scale and they are heavily involved with the planning. Sarah has attended most of the planning meetings in Windsor with her daughter, while Andrew has helped organize the service, reception and wedding party. Fergie has also turned to her friend Anna Wesco to oversee the design of the marquee.